Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. I'm sitting on my floor. What's new? So today's video I thought of literally like last night so oops it was super last minute i have been planning several halloween costumes don't know when i'm gonna wear them all but one in particular i know that i'm wearing in a few days at magic kingdom because i'm going again but this time i'm actually dressing up and it is my sister's birthday that week so we're celebrating her birthday by doing like two park days as you all know and i've said it like every single week since halloween season started i'm obsessed with this holiday so i always really get into my costumes and i always do them myself so I figured why not make a video out of it this year so obviously it's already in the thumbnail so you guys already know what I'm gonna be throughout this past year basically I've gotten a lot of comments from people that I look like Rey from Star Wars so of course I'm very honored by that compliment because I love Rey. My family is actually, they're all doing their own costumes. So like each person is doing their own. We didn't want to do a group one. I don't think we ever do group ones. It's really funny. We always end up having our own ideas. So that's why I decided to go with Rey. I'm going to film the whole process of making it over the course of however long it takes me. I looked up a picture just to like remember exactly what her outfit looks like. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to order some like capri white leggings off Amazon or something. I just need to find some sort of like white tank top or white t-shirt to like wear underneath because you're barely gonna see that anyway the one thing that I know where I'm going to get it is the fabric that she has across just yeah across her I don't know if I should get a bed sheet or if I should just go to Joanne fabrics and I think I'm just gonna go to Joanne so we're gonna go ahead and do that let's go Hey guys, I was just in Joann's. I literally pulled into a new parking space all the way in the back of the parking lot so that no one would watch me while I'm vlogging. <laughs> yes, I still get that embarrassment, so uh, sorry. Don't know if that's ever gonna go away. I found this like gauze looking kind of fabric. The sun's like glaring on it, so there we go. I looked like such an idiot in there because I never go to Joann to buy fabrics. Like I never do that. I just go there for like art stuff. So I got extra so that I'd have enough to kind of cut off the bottom to use for like the wrist things to like wrap around my arms and then she has this leather piece on her arm and part of me wanted to buy some leather to do that and I don't really want to like overspend on this costume I don't know we'll see but I'm very happy that I found that fabric so that's out of the way stay tuned for the rest hey guys so I've just kind of accepted that you're gonna see me multiple times right after a shower no makeup it's been a few days tomorrow is the day that we're going to Magic Kingdom I am actually gonna be going over to my family's and I'm just gonna stay there for the night so that it's easier because we're getting up really early to get ready and everything And I wanted to show you guys the stuff that I ordered off Amazon So I ended up going on Amazon and ordering a pair of just basic white capri leggings because Ray wears these like white capri pants So I haven't actually looked at them yet, but yeah, they're pretty nice Hopefully they won't be too see-through because they are white I also was struggling to figure out the leather piece thing I looked on Amazon and I found this this leather bracelet so I'm just gonna use this and I'm gonna put it around my wrist I'm just gonna put it on my wrist over top of the white fabric that I wrap around my arm and then in terms of the shirt I just found the closest thing that I could find which is this white tank top that I have so we have the white tank top and the white leggings so I feel like that should be good for underneath and then what I'm trying to do is find a belt because she wears this belt I looked around online didn't really find anything so I'm trying to figure out if maybe one of my siblings has a brown belt that I could borrow so now I have almost everything the last Last thing I need to find is a pair of shoes because she wears these brown boots and I don't have brown boots. Hopefully somebody else, maybe one of my sisters, has a pair that I can use. So we will see. I have all the fabric here. I ended up going back to Joann's to get more fabric because I am stupid and when I initially went there to get the fabric, I didn't actually get enough. So I ended up going back and I got more of the same fabric so that I can use that for my arms. I do need to cut up the fabric. I might honestly do it real quick before I head over to my family's house. The fabric is really wide, like the piece that I have, so all I have to do is cut it right down the middle. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut this fabric. So I ended up cutting the next piece because I just don't want to deal with it later. Let me try to explain this so that y'all understand me. What I realized is that she does have a piece that's around her waist to keep these staying crisscrossed. I had extra fabric on the other piece, so I cut some off of there and that is going to go around my waist somehow. So we have that, okay? 
Okay, so we have the two long pieces, we have the piece for around my waist, then we have the pieces for my arms. That is all we have for now. I'm gonna talk to you guys tomorrow. I'll show you my makeup, my hair, everything, whatever I figure out for the rest of the costume. Good morning, guys. This is Charlie, my dog. Hey guys, so I'm gonna do my makeup first because I don't feel like changing right now. So I'm gonna look up a makeup tutorial for her. I already did my foundation, so I'm just gonna follow the rest on this video. So here we go. my camera on just letting you know hi I'm sure you guys can guess who she's gonna be no come back yeah she's Ursula Katie my sister Katie made that necklace like she literally made the shell out of clay can you believe that I right that is it she has a lot of contouring so that's what I tried to do hi guys <laughs> Okay, so that is Rachel. She's the only person I haven't introduced yet, but she was at college. Okay, look at, look at Valerie's costume. She's Smee. So I'm in my glasses. Like I actually would wear those on like on a daily basis. I would wear those. And she's gonna be Vanellope and it's not fair because I wanted to be her one year and I never did, so. And she has a bunch of candy that she got from Amazon and she's putting it all in her hair. Close up, look at her hair. And I'm a little scared of you. Huh? Katie made that skirt. We literally made everything. Oh, also, by the way, I finally figured this out. Okay. Hey, guys. Oh, that's not a good angle. I'm Ray Skywalker. I probably should be doing this last and doing it now. All right. Huh? Do you still want the lightsaber? Yes, please. Oh, my God. I'm so excited. And then I think we're going to put this over top. She's gonna be Mama Odie. By the way, Mama Odie is from Princess and the Frog. Okay. Now I gotta go get my belt. I literally just found it on the floor. It looks kind of weird with the buckle. I'm literally balancing my camera on a cereal box. Is that a real Twizzler? Yeah. Ew. What do you mean ew? Can you put a real Twizzler in there? I couldn't find anything else. I probably should have done the hair before I put these things on my arms. Oh yeah, also I turned my belt around. I gather up a small section of hair above your forehead. Okay, <laughs> I look really bald, but this is really coming along. I can't get this left bobby pin, help me. We're going to go get some hairspray. <laughs> and here's Everybody. Boo. Let me actually go somewhere to show the whole costume because it's just been chaotic. Hey, like, I was gonna take my hat. Hey, like, no, I was gonna take my hat. And here's my hair. Actually though, comment below. Do I look like her now? Now that I'm I literally just, wearing her costume. And I made this. She on. made this out of and clay. Then I, oh my gosh, look at this cutie. <laughs> Boo, I'm your biggest fan. And she has these little... That was in her hair. Okay, I went upstairs where it's more quiet so you guys can get a full shot of my outfit. But here we go. Head to toe, this is the outfit. And then my sister is lending me these boots. My sisters have lightsabers and I wanted to use one for a picture because I wasn't about to carry that around the park, but we can't find them. I'm not used to seeing myself without bangs. So this is like really weird. I'm doing a final summary of the costumes. Okay, we've got Vanellope Von Schweetz from Wreck-It Ralph. She literally has the full costume. She is Mama Odie from Princess and the Frog. She has her stick. Then we have Smee from Peter Pan. And then we have Boo from Monsters Inc. And then my mom is Ursula, but I don't know where she went. She's behind you. She's really behind you. Oh, and she's Ursula. And this is like basically homemade.